An American aircraft carrier is a massive and complex machine that is built to project military power around the globe. These ships are designed to operate as mobile air bases, allowing the United States to launch airstrikes, provide air cover, and respond quickly to global crisis. The United States has a lot of aircraft carriers for a few key reasons. First and foremost, aircraft carriers serve as a powerful symbol of military strength and projection of power around the globe. They are mobile air bases that can be deployed to any location, allowing the US to respond quickly to global crisis and maintain a strong presence in key regions. Secondly, aircraft carriers are a versatile and flexible platform for military operations. They can be used for a variety of missions, including airstrikes, reconnaissance, and humanitarian aid. They also serve as a launching point for fighters, bombers, and other aircraft, giving the US a significant military advantage in a range of scenarios. Aircraft carriers are an essential component of the US Navy's power projection capabilities. With their ability to move around the world quickly, they provide a rapid response force that can be deployed to any location. This allows the US to respond quickly to global crises and maintain a strong presence in key regions around the world. Currently, the largest aircraft carrier in the world is the Gerald R. Ford class aircraft carrier, USS Gerald R. Ford CVN-78. The carrier is named after the 38th President of the United States, Gerald Ford, and is first of its class. USS Gerald R. Ford is designed to be the most advanced aircraft carrier ever built with a number of new technologies, including an electromagnetic aircraft launch system EMOS, and an advanced arresting gear AAG system, which allows for the launch and recovery of aircraft at high speeds and with great accuracy. The ship is also has a larger flight deck and an improved weapons handling system. The USS Gerald R. Ford is commissioned in 2017 and is currently in service with the United States Navy. The United States military strategy and the reason why they continue to invest in this technology. One of the key advantages of aircraft carriers is their ability to launch aircraft from a location far away from the shore. This allows the United States to launch airstrikes and reconnaissance missions in areas that would otherwise be inaccessible. Additionally, aircraft carriers can act as a deterrent to potential adversaries as their presence in a region can signal a willingness to use military force if necessary. Aircraft carriers also play a crucial role in humanitarian aid operations. They can be quickly deployed to disaster-stricken areas, providing a platform for search and rescue operations, as well as delivering supplies and aid to those in need. The United States Navy's aircraft carrier fleet is continuously modernized to ensure they remain the most advanced in the world. The Gerald R. Ford class aircraft carrier is an example of this with new technologies such as the electromagnetic aircraft launch system EMELS, and the advanced arresting gear AAG system, which allow for the launch and recovery of aircraft at higher speeds and with greater accuracy. These technologies not only improve the operational capabilities of the carrier, but also increase the safety of the air crews. Aircraft carriers are a vital component of modern naval warfare and the United States has long been a leader in their development and use. In this article, we will explore the history of aircraft carriers and why there are so many of them in the United States. The concept of an aircraft carrier can be traced back to the early 1900s, when naval officers began experimenting with the idea of launching and recovering aircraft from ships. The first successful launch and recovery of an aircraft from a ship took place in 1910, when Eugen Ely fly a B-plane off the deck of the USS Birmingham. However, it wasn't until the 1920s and 1930s that aircraft carriers began to be developed as a true weapon of war. During World War II, aircraft carriers played a crucial role in the war effort. They were used to launch airstrikes against enemy ships and bases, as well as to provide air cover for convoys and amphibious operations. The United States Navy, in particular, made extensive use of aircraft carriers in the Pacific Theater, where they played a key role in the defeat of Japan. After the war, aircraft carriers continued to be an important part of the United States Navy. They were used in the Korean War, the Vietnam War, and other conflicts around the world. 
The United States Navy has continued to develop new aircraft carrier technologies, including the development of nuclear-powered aircraft carriers, which are capable of sustained high speeds and longer deployment times. In conclusion, aircraft carriers have been a critical component of the United States Navy for decades, and they will continue to play an important role in the future. Their ability to project power, provide air cover, and act as a rapid response force make them an essential tool in the United States military strategy. The investment in advanced technologies and the continued modernization of the carrier fleet ensured that the United States will continue to possess the most advanced and capable aircraft carrier fleet in the world.